This is a wireless notice board that provides an efficient way to display messages remotely using a smartphone, eliminating the need for manually updating notices. It is ideal for school offices and public spaces. Let's dive into it. Here's what we will need for this project. An Arduino Uno, an HC05 Bluetooth module, one 16 by 2 LCD with I2C module, one USB cable, some jumper wires, and one mobile phone to run the Bluetooth app. Let's start by setting up the connections. First of all, take the Arduino port. Now take the Bluetooth module. Connect the VCC pin of the HC05 module to the 5V pin on the Arduino. GND pin of Bluetooth to the GND on Arduino. Next, connect the TXT pin of the HC5 to the Arduino RX pin and the RXD pin of the HC5 to the Arduino's TX pin. Next, take the LCD display with I2C module. Connect the SCL pin of the I2C module to the corresponding E5 pin of the Arduino. SDA to E4 of Arduino connects its VCC to 5V on Arduino. Finally, connect its GND to the GND of the Arduino. Make sure to double check your connection with the circuit diagram. Now download the code and library files given in the description below. Open the code file in the Arduino IDE. Let's begin by including the necessary libraries for our project. We will use the wire.h and liquid crystal underscore i2c.h libraries for the LCD display and software serial.h to handle Bluetooth communication. Next, we define the LCD's I2C address and initialize both the LCD and the Bluetooth model. In the setup function, we initialize the LCD and turn on the backlight. We also set up the Bluetooth module at the baud rate of 9600. Now let's move to the loop function. This continuously checks for incoming Bluetooth messages and display them on the LCD. This code listens for incoming messages from the Bluetooth module, stores them in a string variable and prints the received text on the LCD display. And that's it. Now before uploading the code, make sure to remove the TX and RX pins from the Arduino. Then connect the Arduino Zuno to your computer using the USB cable for uploading the code. Select Port and Board in the same menu and select Arduino Uno. And now click on the Upload button. Alright, now connect the TX and RX pin again as connected earlier. Here our Arduino is ready to communicate with the Bluetooth module. You will see the LED on the Bluetooth module start blinking, indicating it's ready to pair. Next, open the Bluetooth settings on your smartphone and scan for new devices. Look for a device name HC5 or HC06 and select it to pair. If prompted for a password, enter 1234 or 4 times 0. Once paired, your smartphone will remember this connection, making it easy to reconnect in the future. Now download this Bluetooth terminal application directly from the link given below in the description and open it and connect to the module. Send a text message and it will instantly appear on the LCD screen. The wireless notice board project demonstrates how we can efficiently transmit and display information remotely. You can further enhance this project by adding multiple screens or integrating voice commands. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Thanks for watching our tutorial.